Hello everyone, welcome to NG Classes YouTube channel for a video lecture series in digital signal processing. In this video lecture we shall consider a numerical realize a cascade form FIR filter for the following system function. H of Z is equal to 1 plus 1 by 4 Z inverse plus Z to the power minus 2 into bracket 1 plus 1 by 8 Z to the power minus 1 plus Z to the power minus 2. So I need to realize this using cascade form. To realize anything onto the cascade form, first what we have to do is, so let me consider the solution. So let me write the cascade form. I must know the gen general form of the cascade form filter realization. First I would have x of n, then I will have a straight line. Yes, after this I will have few blocks, few blocks, 1, 2, 3 and so on. So let me just connect these blocks. Yes, and towards the end I would have the output y of n. At the input I have x of n, at the output y of n. What are these blocks in between? In between I would have the blocks of h1 of z, h2 of z, h3 of z and so on. So this is the general form of cascade form realization. That means if h of z is given, I need to rearrange those things in the product of terms. So if I look at this numerical, it is very much straightforward. It is already there in the form of h1 of z and h2 of z. So this I can uh, call it as h1 of z term and this I can call it as h2 of z term. It is already there in the factored and uh, uh, product of terms form. So now I can realize this using a direct form 1 realization. So let me start with this x of n I will have a straight line and here I would have one adder so I'm realizing this cascade form using the direct form realization direct form 1 so I can realize this using direct form 2 as well as direct form 1 the easiest way to realize the cascade form structure is by making use of direct form 1 so let me yes so here I'm going to have the output y of n. So let me write that. Yes. Now I will uh, uh, 1 plus the 1 means I have to take the input x of n. So this is uh, 1. 1 by 4 z inverse. For that I should have a delay element. So now let me consider a delay element. Yes. I would consider a delay element here and let me join these two things. So after this I am going to get, get x of n minus 1 or z to the power minus 1 and that gets multiplied with the 1 by 4. Is that okay? So now I will multiply that with 1 by 4. So here I am going to consider multiplying this with 1 divided by 4. What should I do next? I have to add that with the previous one. So I would have, I should have one delay element here. And th those two get added up. Next, I should get z to the power minus 2. How do I get z to the power minus 2? Again, I should have one more delay element and after this I'm going to get z to the power minus 2 that should be added with the previous one so hence I'll consider a signal here and I would add that with the previous one so here somewhere here and let me join this to the adder and I should uh, draw the proper arrow marks so what is the multiplying factor? Here it is z to the power minus 2. Hence it just get multiplied with 1. And uh, later I should add all the signals and I would get this. Right? Yes. So just be careful with the arrow marks. Yes, I am done with h1 of z now. So now I have to consider similarly for h2 of uh, z. If I can do that, the task is uh, done. So let me consider a delay element. 
here let me have the straight line first yes after this I will have one delay element yes here I'm going to get the delay element and uh, let me join these things yes after the delay element what I have I have 1 by 8 Z to the power uh, minus 2 so how do I get that let me extend this and yes still this point here I'm going to have uh, one more uh, adder and what is this this is this gets multiplied with 1 divided by 8 then I have Z to the power uh, minus 2 yes here I'm going to have this and let me join these things moving on further yes this gets added with the previous signal which is over here and uh, let me join all these signals together yes and what is the multiplying factor for this this is also z to the power minus 2 so now this is the cascade form realization of the given FIR filter and towards the end uh, we are going to get the output here I am going to call this as y of n thank you so much for watching